The Extension and Advisory Services Division of the Ministry of Agriculture, Fisheries, Food Security and Rural Development, in collaboration with the Food and Agriculture Organization, FAO, conducted a 10-week farmer field school in Babano and Sufre. The training focused on responsible pesticide management with the goal of minimizing the use of hazardous pesticides in cabbage and tomato production by testing safer alternatives. In a joyous celebration, a graduation ceremony lauded the accomplishments of a cohort of 22 farmers who completed the Farmer Field School program, underscoring their unwavering commitment to adopting sustainable practices. National Focal Point and Biodiversity Specialist of the FAO, Lishan Monrose, highlighted that under the European Union EU funded program for capacity building related to Multilateral Environmental Agreement, ACP MEAs 3, the Farmer Field School methodology offers a vital platform for stakeholders to interact, integrate innovative efforts, and participate in discovery based learning through hands on experiences. The FAO is pleased to have partnered with the Ministry of Agriculture to deliver these farmers field schools in Regions 1 and 2 and Region 6. Through the excellent facilitation of the extension officers, the tenacity of the participants, capacity was built in both farming communities to reduce the use of hazardous pesticides in cabbage and tomato production by testing safer alternatives. Additionally, these farmer field schools were especially impactful as they exposed farmers to a wide range of topics aimed at creating sustainable livelihoods and profitable and resilient agribusinesses through environmentally friendly agricultural production. Acknowledging the FAO's efforts in promoting environmental sustainability in agriculture, Minister for Agriculture, Fisheries, Food Security and Rural Development, Honorable Alfred Prosper, highlights that ongoing initiatives by the Agriculture Ministry and its partners, aimed at enhancing resilience within the sector, serves as a beacon of hope for the future of agriculture, emphasizing the importance of sustainable practices, collaboration and continuous innovation in building resilient agri-food systems. We are grateful for the support provided for the program for capacity building related to multilateral environmental agreements in ACP countries phase three. We take this opportunity to reiterate our commitment to a greener economy. We remain co cognizant of the challenges of ensuring we remain a food secure nation. As such, we welcome the efforts of our farmers in their commitment to move away from agri-food systems driven by intense use of inorganic pesticides and fertilizers to, sustainably, to sustainable production systems characterized by reduction of pesticides use on greater reliance on organic solutions. Congratulations to our graduates and hats off to our engaging extension officers. The insights gained from the Farmer Field School experience in St. Lucia will guide forthcoming activities throughout the OECS under the ACP MEAs 3 project, fostering increased regional collaboration and the dissemination of best policies and practices. From the Communications Unit of the Ministry of Agriculture, I am Anicia Antoine reporting.